like a jacket ball. Well, probably like a jacket ball. Jacket ball. Oh yeah. <laughs> all right, man. So I'm sitting here with Anton. He came all the way from SoCal just for the convention, just hanging out. But um, not only is he a musician that I like to jam with, you you just recently shot a uh, fan-made uh, Dragon Ball Z film, right? Yeah. Dude, so, so man, tell everybody about that, dude. Um, well, it's all fan-funded. It's by a company. Hi. It's okay. See, look at that. He has tons of fans already. Um, <clears throat> it's by a production company called Robot Underdog, which is a big like nerd feed site that you yeah. do like updates on everything from comic books to anime. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice has no, been it's... dead this whole we, time. We've, we've, been, we've been jamming and singing. So but uh, yeah, it's it's a great yeah. project. Um, they spend a lot of time on the casting, not not only making sure people can fight and look the part, but they can actually act the part. Um, very talented people like Amy Johnson, who uh, plays 18, and she's she's been in everything. She was in recently, she was in the, the new Captain America movie as a stunt double. Uh, we have our friend Taylor Tackett, who is uh, a very talented actor. Um, this is the kid that playing Trunks, Jack Wald, is an XMA uh, performer, and like this the most hyper little kid that you'll ever see. <laughs> he's like nine. He's nine years old, and he's like already like phenomenal. Um, uh, the producers have been putting out like content like crazy. Uh, if you go to robotunderdog.com and check it out, or check out the Facebook page. Um, it's it's pretty hard not to find nowadays because I think Dragon Ball Z is one of those things where it's, as soon as one thing comes up, it just it blows up. So it's, it's pretty easy to find, but. We, we've had a, we've been swung with wires in the middle of the desert. Yeah, we've been, I've been like thrown into a little kid. <laughs> uh, I got punched by androids. Uh, it's, it's, it's looking really, really good. And the, the fight choreographer, uh, his name is actually Lohan, uh, like did an excellent job of keeping the feel of the fighting. So I think the fans will really enjoy it because it's, it's close to the anime, but there's also that feel of like realism. Oh, okay. So where, where can we see this, man? Uh, it's gonna be on YouTube. It's gonna come out in like episodes. Uh -huh. So. So it's an episodic. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, it's planned out for three episodes, maybe more if things go well. Um, but this is based off the history of Chunk storyline, so it's a pretty uh, concrete thing. It's yeah. It's pretty just like one shot. Oh, right. Out there, uh, but yeah, RobotUnderdog.com. Uh, and their YouTube page, uh, Robot Underdog. So any other shout outs you want to give? Uh, shout out to uh, Donnie and Rita for making this happen. Uh, shout out to all the fans that have been supporting uh, the Kickstarter and um, or Indiegogo. I actually should know this, I forgot which one they used. But shout out to all the fans that helped donate and support this awesome project because we really appreciate it and we do it for you guys. All right, you heard it, Robot Underdog. Robot Underdog, there you go. All right, check it out. Check, 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 check